What about Lewis as we move on here, turning the ashes of a deceased relative into diamonds? This was a story on NPR and it is incredible. There's a Swiss company called Algordanza, which takes cremated human remains and under very high heat and very high pressure that mimic the conditions deep within the earth that create diamonds, compresses the human remains into diamonds. Rinaldo Willy is the company's founder and CEO. He says he came up with this idea about 10 years ago and that his customer base now reaches 24 countries. He says every year they take the remains of 800 to 900 people. And three months later, they exit as diamonds to be kept in a box or turned into jewelry. He says most of the st stones come out blue because of trace amounts of boron in the human body, although occasionally one will come out yellow or gray or black. Most of the people are being delivered. The remains are being delivered by relatives of the deceased. What do you think about this? It costs five thousand to twenty two thousand dollars. It costs as much as some funerals. And this is the same laboratory process that is used to create synthetic diamonds. It basically reduces the ash into carbon and then applies intense heat and pressure for weeks. And then you basically have something that closely resembles a diamond. Most of the time, according to Willie, People take the diamonds to jewelers and then they make it into like a ring or a pendant that you can actually physically wear. Yeah, I think it's kind of creepy and it's pretty pricey, but it makes um, much more sense than than burying people, which eventually due to the population increases will just be impractical. Um, but uh, also, as I've said before, I, I find something appealing about being buried and returning to the earth, uh, yada, yada, yada. So uh, I don't know if it makes people happy. Good. Uh, this right. Is well, great. that's the question. Is it just another way for people to deal with the kind of fear of or uncertainty around death, either if you are the one having this done to your relative or if you sign up to have this done to yourself when when you pass away? It really changes the meaning of the term family jewels, though, doesn't it? It really does. And you know what? This is a much better way to get diamonds than um, than those blood diamonds or conflict diamonds. Right. That's a fair point. Yeah, that's a, that, that's an industry that I want nothing to do with.